All right, so here's the deal. Uh, Devin's launching me, and he's been wanting to fish this lake really bad. But I'm gonna offer him a little challenge because he can't say no. Like he won't do it. So I'm gonna I'm gonna offer him. I think we're gonna call it the Chopo Challenge. Like he he won't say no. But he thinks we're just like coming to fish and film another thing. We haven't done a challenge episode yet, so he's all fired up, wanting to throw all these other kind of baits. And I'm gonna hit him with the Chopo Challenge. Do a challenge video. Challenge? What do you mean? Like, I think we should do a, a Chopo challenge. <laughs> All right, give me some details. 100 bucks, biggest two fish. All right, so you have a chance if we do it that way, dude. I am, I'm in. I am in. Okay, All it's right. a full send. So, 100 bucks, got to Venmo the guy at the end of the day. So, when you put a little a little coin on the line, man, it, it's on. It takes it to a whole, totally different level. Okay. I didn't come here to play, man. I quit school because I had a playground. <laughs> so, I'm just telling you, you're laughing, but whenever you see my phone at the end of the day, and it says, Justin Lucas sent you $100, it's over. Right. Tell me. What do you think about this pocket? Let's do it. I like it. Got shade, little fog. Yeah. All right. Um, rock, paper, scissors for front. Yep. Whoever gets it first, uh, best out of three. Or? So one, two, send. Yep. All right. Best out of three. Ready? One, two, send. One, two, send. <laughs> God, that sucks. He's got morning bite on the front deck. Hopefully you don't get smoked out of the back. Turn this drag down a little bit just in case I catch one of my beads. Are you kidding me? Oh, yes, sir. Already? Oh, There's a log. The There's a log. I gotta get him over that log, dude. Oh, he's on the log. Oh, he's on the log. You got him. Oh, he's on the log. That's a huge spot, dude. No way. Yes. Oh, my God. Look at the one with it. Look at the one with it. Oh. Oh, my gosh, dude. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Get in the boat. Mm. A spot. The on one a with it was bigger than this one. You gotta be kidding me. Oh my goodness, man. That was cool. That was like third cast, bro. Wait, the pliers. The one with it, man. Did you see it? Uh uh. Oh, I got the scale turned on. I'm feeling it, man. You might as well go ahead and get that application prepared. Freaking crap talker. We'll see what happens. Oh. I don't know. Don't get your hopes up, dude. Here. 538. Shut the <laughs> shut the freak up, dude. 213. I'll give you 213. Call it at 213. Look at this fish. Nice fish, man. He's long and skinny. Alright, we'll get to the back, bro. Get to the back. Take the scale. Get get out of get hey. Gosh dang. That happened quickly. That was awesome. We picked this little pocket right here because as you can see, the sun's starting to get up, but there's still some nice shade in here. And I think we'll be able to catch them on top water all day, but for as long as we can get some shady banks, that's what we want. The water's really clean. It's actually clearer than I thought it would be. So I might have to switch from black, uh, maybe to something else later, but for the morning, black's a good, good color to start with. Obviously, Devin just caught one. Awfully aggressive with the cast there, Devin. Let's see how this is gonna be. A 
Look at him. He's right there. Four or five pounder. Is he? Yep. Dang it, dude. Dude, as soon as it hit the water. Don't go by he that He is dog. digging, man. Thank God I got braid on. It's another spot. This is insane. He's got one with him. I know, I see it. This is another spot. Bro. Freaking spots on choppos up Look on the Look at that bank. spotted bass. Oh, wow. I don't even think super long. Like, dude, if he was fat, that's I don't a four even, pound spot. I don't even think it hit the water. I barely did. Like, I mean, I, I didn't even. I don't even think I turned the reel handle. I really don't think I did. Liars. All right, might freaking have you. Might have you beat here for one. But we're doing biggest two bagger. There. Wow. I did not expect to be catching spots doing this. The one either. I missed was a largemouth, but that's a big old spot. Good looking fish though, dude. Hold up. You don't oh. want to? Oh, you ain't gonna wait. You can throw it. <laughs> that dude, I been, almost did let that it go. That would have been on sucked. you. Gosh, I should have let you do it. That would have been on you. All right. Three pounds, three ounces. Yeah. Three, three. So 213 to 33 three right 213 to 33. Three. Okay. That was a heck of a fight for a 3-3. Three, three. Like, I'm impressed with how strong that fish was. Sun's still climbing. We're still chasing these shady banks. So far, the key has been uh, getting on the banks that have some wood. You can see some of these laydowns right here mixed in with this rock. And we're fishing really fast. I've had the trail motor like on 50 to 70 the whole time. Just trying to cover a bunch of water. And so far, so good. Another good spot. Do you have one with it too? No, I ain't seen it. <laughs> Dang, dude. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Is there any largemouth in this lake? Oh, no. I'm not really mad at it though, are you? No. Get you? I'll get you. Okay. Barely. God, it got me again, man. They're so mean. That was almost bad. I'll yeah. tell you that. Yeah. I mean, it got me pretty good. But... All right. Let's get a weight on him. What do you think? He's fat, dude. dude. That might be the biggest one. That's where it got you? Yeah. It was almost bad. Dang, dude. That's what I get for being an idiot. That almost got me again. Two. Twin. Right. 213. Call 213? It. Yep. All right. Before I bleed out, <laughs> you got stuck. I'm gonna catch a bigger one, but that's yeah. still legit. Nice one. Freaking weed eater over there, or blower. Always something, Campbell. So it seems that 214 to 33 is average. That fish legit kicked your butt, dude. You got your butt whooped by a two pound, 14 ounces? Yeah, or? that had just done a full straight up syringe of meth. <laughs> you remember when you asked me about those fusion hooks? Pretty good. They're good, bro. Told you.
Dude. I'm gonna stop mine real quick. Get it. Got him. Dude, he followed it up. Hold on. He's not gonna help me though. Dang. I don't really want to catch him though, bro. These fish are mean. Dude, I threw up there. He missed it. Just sitting there. And then I started swimming it and he just followed it and chased it back and then I saw him eat it. He's not bad. I need to get a weight on him. What is that? 5'8"? Yep. Yep. See ya. Alright guys, so I'm in the back right now. Uh, we have caught still at four fish, but wanted to give you guys a rundown of kind of the time of year and water temp and what these fish are doing. Uh, water temp is 81. Beginning of fall, these fish are definitely up feeding. Probably some bait. We know there's herring in this lake, but there's also a lot of big bluegill. So I think it's probably a mixture of both uh, that they're eating. Wouldn't you say so, Devin? There's huge bluegill in here. So long cast is really important. The water's super clear here, so we want to get the bait as far away from the boat as we can. We're going to keep going at it. So far, so good. Only been out here like an hour and a half and four bites, and their you know, quality is probably two and three quarter to three pounds. So I think we'll get some nice ones. There's a battery. Mm -hmm. Just run that for a minute. Dude, oh my gosh. That was sweet. Come here. That's a large mouth. Will that be enough to overtake Devin? What'd you have? 5'11", I had 5'8". This is gonna go with my 3'3". Three, three. I think I might overtake you here, bro. I don't know, man, he's pretty skinny. All right, dude, 2'11". 2'11". 5'14". 5'14 to 5'11". Thank you. I needed you bad. All right, let's get you back in the water. Thank you. 514, three ounce lead. Oh, and dude, I think I officially still get the front because- You officially really do. That's probably the only way. That's the fair way to do it. You took a break, I took advantage. Sorry. <laughs> Damn. Game mode, dude. Oh. oh, bro. That was awesome. That Pretty was legit. so cool. That's Tell like me you saw all that. Dude, what are you laughing at? I still have the lead. I don't know what the hell you're laughing at. That sucked to lose it though. <laughs> Amazing. All right guys, when I'm throwing this chopper like this, burning down the bank, uh, I like doing straight braid. These fish are not line shy. This is a really aggressive bait. So we have 50 pound braid on here. Uh, it's a seven foot three medium heavy rod. So uh, this bait's got bigger treble hooks on it and you need something a heavy is just too stiff so medium heavy is perfect seven foot three devin's using a seven foot four right dude yep. yeah he's using a seven foot four with 50 pound braid 
and then we both have uh, fast reels, seven threes and eight to one gear ratios just to cover as much water as we can. Really simple setup and you guys are seeing what we're doing. We're stopping the bait a little bit, you know, from time to time, burning it a lot and then stopping it, pausing it. And a lot of bites are coming when we're pausing it. Don't need a crazy setup for this. Uh, just anything that's a seven three or seven four medium heavy and a seven or eight to one gear ratio reel and straight braid, you'd be good to go. Dude, we've been out here like eight hours and for the last two hours it's been it's been tough and this morning you know the indication was it was going to be an awesome day i mean what are you saying i mean are you do you want to go i mean i'm willing to no, give it i'm willing to quit no right? dude dude i love to gamble but and i also when i lose i lose you know what i mean i'm down three ounces right yeah 514 um, to 511. Yeah, it's been a while since we put one in the boat. So I'm good with losing the 100 bucks. We've got two legit stakes that you bought for us. So I'm going to win in that area. It's a wash. It's a wash. Because the, the first part of the morning was, was well worth it. You know what I mean? Yeah, I agree. It was, it was good this morning. Yeah. Eight hours, we put five in the boat and had four or five other bites but dude they're just not getting it i don't know man just because of the last couple hours it's been tough odds are against me i know the odds are against me i'm in the back of the boat i haven't taken control of the front of the boat so all right i'm good with it dude all right well let's show one last time what we're using a 50 pound braid yep seven three medium heavy rod devin's throwing yep. the seven four uh, and he threw the 105 size Chapo and I'm throwing the 120. So all that stuff is going to be linked below. Uh, take you to tacklewarehouse.com to check it out if you want to see it. But I'm good with it, dude. I guess the last thing is I need that Venmo, son. I super hate losing, but losing to you is even worse. <laughs> well, I feel the same way. If that's any consolation. All right, dude. One zero zero. I want to hear my cha-ching. Don't be a sore loser about it either. I'm not, but I'm gonna charge you 9% tax. Send. Oh, that's <laughs> beautiful. Paid you 100. A turd and a fish. You've even got the cha-ching, man. I know. I'm um, playing around, bro. I got $561 in that account Made it now. even worse. It was fun, bro. Seriously. It was fun. Enjoyed it. Yep, me too. Let's go find another lake for the <laughs> evening and cook some bomb steaks. I'm ready to send it, man. Hey guys, thanks for watching this video. Devin and I appreciate it very much. Make sure to hit the like button, subscribe if you feel like it. We have a bunch of great other content out there. You'll see the links on the screen right now and make sure to hit those and watch some other stuff as well for some more great information and awesome fish catching content.